Hi, I'm Sandra DePuri. Uh, this is Yeringberg. I'm going to give you a mini guided tour. So this is the, the old winery. We call it the press room because this is where the original grape press was. So it's quite an extraordinary building, uh, built in the 1860s to 1880s, all made out of wood. Um, we're really lucky it hasn't burnt down in that period of time. So we can see in here um, all kind of winemaking equipment from the era when my great-grandfather and my grandfather made wine. We don't make wine here anymore, we make wine downstairs in the cellar. So we used to, in about 1915, have a shop in Collins Street in Melbourne. Um, not anymore. But in those days we produced heaps more wine than we do now. These, as we go past, the 2019 release, um, fabulous set of wines from a really, really good Yarra Valley vintage. You can see over here one of the big fermenters. Um, all the red wine was fermented in great big fermenters. There used to be six of them. We've got two left. And they had heading down boards to keep the skins in. And when they were ready to press the grapes, there's a door here. I guess somebody would get inside, try not to get too much CO2. And the grapes were shoveled out into a press, which was on the floor here. They did have a pump, no electricity of course, but this is a two person piston pump, one person on each side, and you can spin it around and move the wine. A lot of it was done by gravity. Um, underneath this building is the cellars. And so after pressing, a lot of the wine, or the wine, would go through hoses. Uh, there's a few spots on the floor, here's one where you could lift up the, the floorboards and run a hose down to the cellar below. Shall we go upstairs to the mm -hmm. top level? So the process with gravity is, um, because they didn't have electricity, it, it made sense to run it as a, uh, with a gravity system. You coming up there? Yep. So you can see that this top level is suspended from the ceiling. Um, and so the grapes were lifted up on the outside using a big old steam engine, lifted up to the top level. The crusher was on the top level. And then the grapes were moved around on the railway track in the little wagon. And then they could be tipped into the fermenters. So that way, essentially, the grapes were just lifted once and then gravity did all the work. Mm 